What's going on, guys? It's your boy Maximum RPM coming at you with another video today. But there's something off about this setting. Is it the lights? Is it the decor? How about a change of setting? Ah, that is much better. If you guys do not know, this is the Super Stadium. And guys, I got a little treat for you. This is something that I'm going to be working on. For those who don't know what that is, it is a coin purse. And I hold my quarters in it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to have quarter hunting Beyblade. I will take my quarters, roll them up, exchange them for cash. Then I will buy a Beyblade with it. And basically, I'm going to be buying Beyblades with quarters. Um, this way I can save my cash for other things like my RC car and like other essentials things. <laughs> um, you guys know I just like to be goofy, and it's a, it's an interesting little thing that I want to try. Um, so. Instead of trying to figure out some way to make it fair for the redemption rounds, I'm just going to have one big thing. We're all one big happy family. <laughs> I'm in a really good mood, guys. Um, And so let's go over the contestants. The King of Carnage. Rocking a combo that I let him use. So next time... Bladers Nation, I want I'm challenging you. Make a combo that can take this down. Wyvron Heavy Iron. Random Beyblade Gamer Extreme. Never mind. Random Beyblade Gamer. Sorry. Rocking a Giga Gyanon. Zero Revolve. Which has done really good in the tournament. And the king of the redemption rounds. Star after flock with Dragoon Quarter Guard. So let's just get right into this, guys. I mean, what the heck? What's the weight? The disc quarter hard. So Bladers Nation did get that burst, but we are doing this on um who can be the last one standing. But if someone gets like burst both Beyblades, then they get four points. We are going to five points with this. So that is one zero zero. The last Beyblade standing is the one that gets the points, unless you can burst both of them. Oh no! Gyna or a uh, Wyron stall that landed on the flat part of iron. Went into a neutral position. The Dragoon circled around. That's one to one to Ooh, that was close. It's one to one to zero. Bladers Nation has got zero points, but is ruling the battle. So here we go. So we nailed one burst. Everything's just a little fuzzy. What? How do I call this? I'm going to ow, call that a burst finish. Actually, no, I'm going to use that as one point. Um, so, it didn't even take any damage. So that's two, one, zero. 
Blader's Nation has been ruling the entire fight, but hasn't gained a single point. The Comeback King is living up to his name. Huge hits! There's a burst. Wyvron did get that. Wyvron needs to have that movement speed to be an effective bay. This isn't good. I designed that Wyvron combo on movement. It's made to be in a smaller stadium. Four, one, zero. This is an intense battle. Wyvron is doing a lot of the work for the other bays, but the problem is, Dragoon's just stealing all that spin. What they need to do is get Dragoon out of the way. Huge hit! Dragoon gets set to the top rail. So it's 4-1-0. How is this going to turn out right here? It's a clean sweep. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. Star after Flock gets back into the tournament. So congratulations. He's gone through two redemption rounds. Well, let's see how these two will face off, because I still want to find the third place bay. One, zero. Huge hit! I know that attack did some damage. And it did. That is two to one. This Wyvron combo is a beast when it can build up some momentum. That's all it needs is just a little bit of speed on its side. And it's got the battle underway. Wyvron reaching the outer rail and sending Guyanon into one of them. So the way it works, guys, is there are two handles right here. You might even be able to see them sometimes, which you can't right now. But he'll often, Basil, bounce off that and send them down to the middle. The score is 3-1. to one. Guyanon is at the mercy of Wyron. Huge hit! Guyanon went off the bank of the stadium and landed back in. So guys, the way it works is they got those handles right there, which Bays often hit. Guyanon landed and hit that ripple, like that ridge in the stadium and ricocheted off of it. It's three to two. This is a good battle. I don't want this to ever end. And it's close, too. Huge hit. Wide run building speed. Oh no, it's missing. Wide run's got really good stamina, though, so... That was a big hit. That was actually a really good hit. And a burst that is five to two. Lakers Nation. Well, both um random Beyblade Gamer and Bladers Nation are out of the tournament. Bladers Nation, you take second, and random Beyblade Gamer, you take third in their redemption rounds. Guys, don't be ashamed. Redemption rounds are really hard to do because there are so many Beyblades when it's in a format like this. Bladers Nation had the power but didn't have the stamina. And Random Beyblade Gamer had the stamina but didn't have the burst resistancy. Oh well. Well, guys... I just want to say ahead of time, thanks for everyone for joining my tournament. We are not done yet. We still got the regulars to do. And as always, guys, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. You have no clue how much it means to me. Um, Say something nice to someone and make sure that you're always nice to people. Because you never know. Might just make their day better. 
might even save their life if they're battling depression. You always want to be nice to people. You never know what could be going on with them. So that's why you always be nice to people. You never know how some people will take it. And it just makes the world a better place. All right, guys. Ah. <laughs> that was a loud clap. My ears are ringing. All right. I'm out. Like, comment, subscribe. Live life to the max. Stay awesome.